long time since I've seen you again. It's been a few years, few years. Long time, long time. I've been thinking about you every day, every day. Good morning. It is Sunday morning. The weather sucks and um, I'm just getting ready for the day. I woke up, not even kidding you, 20 minutes ago and I'm already feeling like rejuvenated and ready to start my day. <laughs> I slept with the um, band-aids that have like, they're meant for like blister healing, but you could use them on your face. They work wonders for like extracting pimples and such like it's just working really well for me so i'm glad that it has been working well and i only use that on my period like when i need to because they're expensive and i can't use them every single night before i go to work i am going to go to the mall and i have to also drop off a package the mall just opened like it's 11 08 and the mall opens at 11. my mall's really wacky bro like don't my my mall my, my excuse me excuse me i'm gonna put some of this acne spot treatment on the pimples that i don't really trust <laughs> Today, I'm dressing comfortable because I, right now, do not feel well. <laughs> okay, I'm going to leave now because it's already 11.20 and I need to like go do stuff. Outfit, high-waisted black like jersey shorts. I have a cami, black cami, and I have this oversized um, flannel from H&M. And I have my Air Force Ones on. There it is. Damn, that took me forever. God damn. I've arrived at the mall. It's 11.43. I'm listening to Curtis Connors' podcast. Very, really good. Which, by the way, I'm realizing now that almost everyone has a podcast that I thoroughly enjoy watching. So I'm so psyched to like listen to them. Anyway, I bought a three count of munchkins because I was like, why not? And bro, 99 cents for three little munchkies. I respect. This bagel looks delicious. But they did not they did not do a half seas, so I will have to be mm, good. So it's like Monday afternoon. It's like eleven o'clock. I am going into work soon and I'm just not feeling it today. The weather also has sucked booty cheeks so it makes me feel very sad when the weather is like this it hasn't really been sunny and when it has been sunny it's been like 7 or 8 p.m and i'm at work so <laughs> i haven't been able to enjoy the sun in a long time which is really affecting my mood but it's okay um i'll be fine i'm gonna put on my jeans now because i don't put these jeans on until i have to because they're the jeans that stretch i might just order them a size smaller and see like how that goes i don't know bro jeans and me just they i really love them but i just i need to find the right pair and it's not easy this is my outfit for work today very much mom vibes <laughs> i have this black shirt on that i love i wear it every day i got it from target my voice these are those jeans that i just put on and you know I do like them when they're fitted, but they get super loose throughout the day. And I'm just gonna wear my white Vans because I feel like these are super comfy shoes to just throw on. And that's that. <laughs> bit by a bug i see it right here look at that not cool bro this lotion is really great this is uh a maui moisture body care detoxifying and volcanic ash body lotion they sell this actually in a lot of places and it is pretty affordable um but you get a lot of lotion for the price you pay and it absolutely smells amazing whatever Somebody actually told me that like my elbows were ashy and I was like, 
offended but i was like damn i'm glad you noticed that because now i will always be moisturizing my elbows <laughs> um you know gotta do that this is what I have going on right now. I was just unboxing the stuff I bought from Costco for my room. I needed a new pack of these for my toothbrush, so I bought that. Command hooks I needed too because I only had the strips. I bought everything but the bagel seasoning because this I love and I use so much, so that will last me a bit. And I also got some black masks because I still have to wear them on campus and I do wear them at work still so it's good to just have a pack of 75 and I also picked up this Shea Moisture head to toe 100% extra virgin coconut oil because I use coconut oil on my body. I also put a spice rack I'll show you guys. Spin drift on deck. This is where everything has been living for school for like the past month. More, more so, honestly. It's like super cloudy, and then it's like kind of bright right there. And then there it is cloudy again. And there's Russell. He's just living his life, honestly. purchasing just a lot of random stuff throughout the month and months. I'm not gonna bring all of these band-aids to school. Maybe I should like take a look at what they got in here. This is nice, like this little to-go thing. Oh. I made a mistake opening this up. That's all I have to say. Another bag of stuff for school. The way my school does things is definitely weird and I think that COVID didn't help the situation. But actual sweet information, it's supposed to come out in three days. And I looked at my bill today for the semester and I was billed for a Kaufman double, which means that I should have a double apartment as I requested in the Kaufman resident hall, which would be amazing and my roommate said that she had the same exact thing on her bill so my fingers are crossed that me and her did match successfully because i think i'll cry if i get a different roommate that i have no idea who they are um by the looks of it everything is looking good <laughs> i just think that they haven't sent out like the confirmation email yet so um but let's take a look at my college corner you know i think it's doing very well i have that bag full of stuff i have my mattress topper i bought this mini ironing board um, I might return it, I don't know. I just purchased this today because I will have an apartment. I'm, I bought a 20 jar spice rack and I also get free refills for five years. Comes with a lot of spices, my guy. That's 20 spices right there. And then I also have this two pack of things. I don't know. Do you see the mess? There's so much stuff. And you know what? I'm happy about it because I'm making money moves. Um, I bought these pillowcases on Amazon. I was unsure about the type of like vibe I wanted in my dorm. So I picked these up and these are like pillow covers. I really don't know if I like this or not. So I'm waiting to go to Ikea to see if I can find pillow to match this. But I thought that it was pretty minimal. Like there's still a lot happening here, but it's not crazy. Anyway, I have a feeling I'm gonna end up returning these, but this is just one of the things that I've kept. I mean, I've kept the receipts for everything because I don't really know when I'm gonna be needing and what can go back, you know what I'm saying? But I have, I have that, that's a new purchase. My mom was super awesome and she picked me up these bowls today. 10 out of 10. Um, there's so much more guys. Like, I don't even know what, like, what is this mound of stuff? I bought myself like a bag from Italy. I don't know. It was cute. I liked it. Let me show y'all. This is what it looks like 
on like i like wearing it like this because i like functionality but it's just so pretty like it's beautiful look at it it's made in italy it's real leather it plops up like that and inside it has this insert but you can take it out and you just have like the actual full body of the bag which iconic right um and it has the ma it has a magnet that it just attaches to it also can be worn just on the shoulder you know like that like, and i know that it's gonna last a while because i paid a little bit of money for it so i was like a half the work so a couple of items have arrived at my door first we'll start with old navy i purchased this no joke it came very fast laser ship is a very very fast i purchased this bikini top i don't know if i'll like it i didn't know what the back looked like oh gosh i'm gonna hate that aren't i yeah that's not gonna work for me i'm gonna try it on but it will probably be returned because they have no photos of the back so i didn't know um okay second item is from amazon when i go to school i won't be able to do my own nails so i purchased dipping powder glue kit this is what I needed because I already had the uh, everything else to do it. So now I can officially try to do it myself when I have the time to. And then the last item I got today was from American Eagle. The first thing I picked up was this bikini bag because it was on sale for like $6 and it was originally $19. 10 out of 10. Good purchase. And then I also picked up this distress tank top um i don't know if i like this so we'll have to try it on as well it's like this it actually looks pretty large um but we'll try it on hi it's editing kayla here just wanted to say that i returned almost all of that stuff very sad i know hi guys so it's saturday july 31st it's the last day of july which is scary because august is coming around the corner i um haven't picked up the camera in a while so i want to just share with you guys some updates i did find out my move in time and date which is awesome because now i can actually plan around that i have a lot of things going on the month of august and pretty much like the last week of august is move in time which is everything happening at once it's a lot to handle so that's good the second thing is that i also took a trip to ikea so i got pretty much the last bulk of almost all the stuff i need i will have to go shopping with my roommate um when it is that time when i'm with her but for right now everything that i've purchased on my end the rest of it was from ikea so the whole college corner you guys have seen with all my stuff there it's grown because i've added a lot more stuff from ikea and i want to do an ikea haul for you guys i'm gonna figure out how i'm gonna do that but i just picked up some more bags from my friends so um i'm going to start organizing that a little bit more because those bags are what's really helping me through this whole thing uh they're like really large and they help me just get everything together you know what i'm saying they just help me cheers to the last day of july because it's been a great month i'm not gonna lie to you today i spent the day in the city i went to the van gogh exhibit in manhattan and it was really really great i'll insert some footage here I also posted on Instagram because I'm obsessed with this tote bag I bought. I'll show you guys later. But I also want to do a dorm haul of like everything I'm got, I got, which is going to be such a long video. I'm going to start with all of the smaller stuff, which is in these bags and i've been trying to organize everything and it actually works out because i have to take everything out so first thing is i actually purchased a lot of bags i picked up this um white linen blanket it's they call it like a bed cloth because it's like a thin blanket that goes over a bed um i also picked up 
some cubes to divide and organize inside my drawers. So I picked up two packs. I also bought a pillow insert because I did buy a linen cover because I didn't know what type of pillows I want on my bed. And then to go with that, I just bought a black linen cotton material one to go with it. The next thing I got was my duvet cover because I did purchase a comforter which I love Ikea comforters. For my comforter I did decide to go with the warm one. There's cold, light warm, warm, and then like extra warm. So I went with the warm because when I tried it in the store it was really comfortable. I also picked up this laundry basket because when I saw it in the store I was excited because it has one big handle, one small handle. It's made of this really nice like canvas so as you can tell I'm into like the canvas like linen sort of deal. Okay we're gonna move on to like the smaller stuff that isn't bedding. First thing is this colander. I didn't know where to get one and this one was really cheap and it smelled well made so I bought that. I also picked up these like uh, mesh bags I could use for produce or other large objects that won't poke out. <laughs> it's a two pack so I have a small and a larger one. I got some more organization. These I really really liked. So so I bought three of these and I'll figure out I'll figure out something for these you know I got a simple washcloth uh, two just in case I don't know you never know you know I picked up some of these cooking utensils this weird spatula tongs and then this other spatula what is this called then I don't know this is what I got for that <laughs> for part of my decor I got these hanging plants which I really adore um, I got two of them and then this actually is a hanging pot so I can hang this somewhere and then this is just a standalone silver one but I think it looks cool so we'll figure out something to do for that. I got a variety of different sizes of these um, Ziploc bags because Ikea has the best Ziploc bags ever. And then I also got this which is for the kitchen utensils to like organize everything. This is the actual kitchen utensils I bought because I didn't buy them anywhere else so I thought I'd just pick them up there and I don't know if I'm going to be bringing all of them but I picked up a variety of different frames. This one is 7 by 9 but you could probably fit a variety of different sizes in it and it also hangs which I like. Um, and I got a little small white one which is a 4 by 6 and then I got a big boy which is a 12 by 16 so I will be figuring out some things and like probably buying something on Etsy to fill these up. I picked up a big old trash can as well as another mesh one for like my side of the room or whatever. And then I got two larger items. This is the first one. It's this stand shelf which is actually really great. And then I also got that which you don't even know what it is. It's just a box but it's one of those utility carts that are three tiers. 